You don't think it's over. Gul'dan and the devils that command him are not so easily banished. I fear this is only beginning. What's up, everybody watching? Today, World of Warcraft just released its newest Harbingers trailer prior to the release of Legion on August 30th. This particular one stars Khadgar, Gul'dan's arch-rival, who we saw in the last Harbingers trailer. This is one that I'm particularly really anxious to take a look at because Khadgar has played a significant role in Warcraft lore since Warcraft 1. He was in the very first war, he didn't steer off in any of the expansions that I can remember, has played a huge role in Warlords of Draenor, he was our legendary quest line played a role in the ending, which made us realize there was going to be a lot more and the Legion was going to invade. Now, there's been a ton of theories regarding what's going to happen with Khadgar. His mentor was Medivh, who was possessed by Sargeras. Medivh was the Guardian. Now, there's theories that Khadgar will become the possible Guardian in Warcraft Legion, or... The theory that I think is very popular on the internet at this point, Khadgar is a possibility of the final boss and being corrupted by the Fell, just like his mentor Medivh. So I want to see if this particular Harbinger's animated short gives us any clues towards what we're going to see with Khadgar in World of Warcraft Legion. So let's take a look. I'm going to put on the lovely headset we have here, and we're going to react to the Harbingers trailer with Khadgar. See if we can find out any clues as to where this will lead us. Let's begin this. Once again, the Burning Legion has returned. Stronger, more determined than ever before. I venture to Karazhan on a mission of desperation. We're going to start off at Karazhan. That's interesting. He's riding in like a boss on that griffin. Hot and heavy there, Khadgar. Let's see what this is about. My apprentice returns. Indeed. It is good to see you again, Khadgar. Medivh? How? My spirit is bound to this tower. Yes, of course. You look Medivh, suspect. There is so much I need. You look terrible, old friend. Why have you come here? The Burning Legion invades again. I come seeking the knowledge that you kept here. Anything that can help me stand against them. Defeating the Legion this time will take more than some spell, I'm afraid. The very first thing that popped you in my head is artifact weapons. What you need is a weapon. I don't understand. You defeated me when I was consumed by fell madness. But you never took the next step toward your destiny. It is time Azeroth had a guardian once again. A guardian? After your failings, it was decided that none could resist the temptation of such power. We don't need a guardian, Medivh. Well, then, I ask again, why are you here? If not a guardian, if not you, then who can stop the approaching storm? If you cannot embrace your fate, then all you have accomplished, all you have sacrificed, dollar on being destroyed, will have been for nothing. Even if I said yes, none now remain to bestow the powers of a guardian upon me. I remain. I knew this day would come. Before my death, I imbued this tome with an echo of my essence. Open it. It smells Absorb like a trap. Its energies as your own. No, I cannot. I shall. 
should not. The fate of Azeroth rests in your hands, Khadgar. Accept your desires. Show the Legion the true might of a Guardian. Be honest with yourself, if not with me. I have thought about becoming the Guardian every day. Even now, I desire it. I've yearned for the Legion to cringe before the fury so I it? would unleash. And that is why I can never accept your offer. Oh! What is... That's a dreadlord? My will is strong. My brethren were right. You would have served the Legion well. I will never be the Legion's pawn. Oh. And this tower will not be its dead. Oh. I came to Karazam seeking knowledge. What I found was a reminder that no single person, not even a guardian, can stand against the Legion alone. As before, we must band together, united for Azeroth. Wow. Okay. Where to begin with this one? First off, when he was talking about weapons, uh, the first thing that came to my mind was this is the introduction to the artifact weapon system that's going to be in World of Warcraft Legion. That's going to be the weapons, I believe, that destroy the Legion, or that's the way it's looking at this point in time. Seeing Medivh in the beginning was very suspect. I mean, after defeating him... Being corrupted by the Fell, I thought for a long time Sargeras, since he did possess Medivh, would try to possess Khadgar because it looked like Medivh was setting up Khadgar to take over as the Guardian. So if you already had one, why would you not try and take the second one? This also kind of backs theories that I've seen about Legion that Khadgar could possibly be the final boss after being possessed by Sargeras. I remember seeing in certain trailers with Khadgar him saying nobody should behold so much power. Maybe it's going to come down to defeat the Legion where Khadgar is going to have to accept this type of power at some point to destroy them, realizing he was tricked and setting up the stage for him to be the final boss in Legion. I would not like to see Khadgar as the final boss in Legion, but it is a possibility. It would be a twist since he's been such a dynamic character since Warcraft 1. I don't know if that's the way I'd like to see him go down, though. I mean, I feel like Khadgar should eventually be transformed into the Guardian and not a final boss. I'd rather have a battle with Sargeras in the Legion at the end. That's just me. I'm not really sure. Guys, what do you think is the best way to approach the end of Legion. Do you think a Khadgar final boss would be the way to do it, or would you like to go into the void and face Sargeras himself? Because the only way you could kill a Dreadlord or is in the void. I know Sargeras is not a Dreadlord, he is a demon, but the same applies there. This was a really interesting trailer. And I'm still thinking there's more theories you could pull off of this one. That tome really signifies to me that Sargeras is trying to get a hold of Khadgar, and that is going to play some sort of role in Legion. Let me know what you guys think regarding that. I hope he becomes the Guardian. I kind of hope Khadgar becomes the Guardian, because he's been groomed for it the entire time. 
but we're gonna have to wait and see with Legion. I think this animated short was done better than the one with Gul'dan. I enjoyed it more. I didn't expect it. There was an element of surprise because I was not expecting Medivh to turn into a Dreadlord. I was sitting there thinking maybe Medivh is still in the Karazhan Tower possessed by Sargeras. Who knows? It's possible. Legion's coming back. Anything is possible. It's Warcraft. Now, I would also like to throw out there a possible prediction. Hearthstone has an announcement coming up at China Joy. And I'm going to predict that it is going to be a Karazhan adventure mode. Karazhan has been hyped a lot in the WoW universe recently, and to release a trailer slash animated short like this, starring Karazhan in it, the day the announcement is going to be made kind of leads me down that path, that Karazhan will be the next Hearthstone adventure mode. That's just another prediction in this video I'm going to go with. Karazhan would be a sick Hearthstone adventure mode, and it would get people off the Ice Crown Citadel adventure mode for a while. Because, let's face it, Karazhan was one of the best raids ever produced in World of Warcraft, so why not make it a Hearthstone adventure mode? That's what I got off this trailer as a first impression. I cannot wait for the next one. Eildin's Storm Rage I'm particularly excited about seeing. So, that's one I'm waiting for. Guys, I hope you like this reaction. Hope you like this video. Throw some comments down there letting me know what some predictions are for Legion. What you think is going to end up happening. Mind you, I do not know anything that has happened in Legion Beta or anything like that. I have avoided spoilers because I like to play the game through myself. I don't like to watch other people doing it because it kind of ruins the element of surprise. So I don't know anything that's going to happen in Legion. Please avoid the spoilers. Let me know some predictions you guys have. Throw me a like or sub if you enjoy my videos. We'll see what happens. Everybody, thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video. Have a good day or night, wherever you are. Later. Until we meet again.